Apple still sells 16 gigabyte iPhones. Of course, the reason is they want to entice you to upgrade to their mid-tier 64 gigabyte option. But if you have a smaller size device or even a bigger one, but a lot of stuff on it, you might want to optimize your storage to have a little bit more space. So here are three tips to do that. First of all, if you want to have your messages automatically delete, you can go to settings, messages, and choose automatically delete after 30 days as opposed to keeping them forever and ultimately taking up more and more of your storage space. Another thing you can do is if you want to keep those message threads intact, but you have media inside those threads that is taking up space, if you go into your thread and click on details, under at the bottom of the next screen you'll see a, message, uh, a section that says attachments. If you click and hold on one of those images, you click more, then you can go ahead and quickly select all the messages you want. You have an option to save them, or in this case, you have an option to just mass delete them. Of course, those media files are taking up space on your phone, and this will help save that space. The last thing that you could possibly do is if you have a lot of pictures on your device and that's taking up space, you can optimize your iPhone images. What this basically means is that images that are backed up to iCloud, if you're running low on space, uh, an optimized version will be pushed to the phone instead of saving the full definition version on your device. You'll then have the full uh, resolution image saved on iCloud if you want to re-download it later. But to do that, go to Settings, Photos, and Optimize as opposed to keeping all of the images in full definition saved on your device. So that's just quick three, that's just three quick uh, and easy ways to save storage on your iPhone.